Um, with debt collectors, um, people assume when a debt collector comes round that uh, they have actual power to, to uh, um, do something to you, anything to you. They don't. They have no power whatsoever. Um, they only have the power that you give to them. Um, uh, they, they, they're kind of like third party, you know, strangers, interlopers. You know, they've, they've, they're kind of interfering in your, in your financial affairs. You know, you didn't, you didn't contract with them. You know, you don't know who they are. They've just turned up on your doorstep um, demanding money. You know, who are they? You know? Um, so what they do is they, they bully you or trick you into contracting with them. And if you contract with them, now you've got a contract with them, they can, they can um, you know, chase you for money and hound you. For money, they have a they'll have a legal right to to come after you, but and that they, they have nothing until you give them that. And one of the tricks they do um, is they might say, um, yeah, give us give us one pound a, a week or one pound a month. Yeah, just just give us one pound a month. And you know that sounds kind kind of reasonable. You know, especially if you if you really genuinely believe that you have a debt to pay. Yeah, um, yeah, it sounds quite reasonable. But as soon as you start paying them one pound a month, you've just said that you owe them something. So you've contracted it with them. So now that you have to pay them the amount, and that's what usually happens. They'll come after you for the full amount because now they have the, uh, the authority that you've given them to, to, to chase that amount. Now, one of the things that, um, that people often miss when, uh, when the debt collectors come knocking is that these debt collectors have actually paid off your, your debt. They've bought your debt. Um, often for, you know, pennies on the pound. So if, you've, if you apparently owe a thousand pounds, they've probably paid a tenner. Yeah, they've, they've probably paid a, a tenner for it. Um, so but the, the point is, they've paid off your, your debt. So, you know, thank you very much, you know. Um, did I... Did I actually make, go into contract with you to say that I'd pay you back for, for that? You know, you should have probably asked me first before you went around paying off my debt for me, you know. Uh, so where, where's the fear in that, you know? The, these guys rely on, on, on fear to, to, you know, to make you pay up. Um, if you realise that they've got no power over you and in fact they've paid off your debt, thank you very much, you know, where's the fear? Um, you can actually have a lot of fun with them. So um, actually, if, um, if a debt collection company takes over your debt, it's actually a good thing for you. Yes, it's paid off. Paid off? Yeah, the debt collectors have paid off your debt for you. Thank you very much. Give, shake their hands. Thank you very much. Um, so that's it. I mean, you, you, you don't have to have, have fear of these people. Um, a lot of people, uh, you know, like to have a bit of fun with these guys. You know, when they phone up, um, they, they say, uh, hello, oh, oh, you, 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 want, you want Mr. Starbuck? Oh, okay, hold on a second, I'll, I'll just get him. And just creep away from the phone and leave him there for 10 minutes, maybe come back and say, oh, you still there? You still there? Yeah, he's just coming, hold on. And just leave him and they'll soon get the message. Um, yeah, just, just, just have some fun with them and, and leave the fear because I say, that's all they, that's all they rely on, the fear. And when you lose the fear, you know, you know, you're, you're, you're free of them. That's, that's the difference I was trying to tell you, the, the, the fear aspect. Because, you know, most, I call them muggles now, um, most of the muggles, um, you know, they see a debt collector and they're, they're, they're shitting themselves. And they'll, they'll um, fall into the trap of paying them, you know, uh, or, or falling for one of their tricks to contract with them um, because, of, because of the fear of it. Yeah. And once you lose that fear, you know, <laughs> You know, they've got no power over you anymore.